BMW engine! <laughs> That's been down there for a long time. How do you like magnet fishing? It's pretty relaxing, huh? <laughs> oh, magnet fishing? I'm getting that. What is up everyone? I hope everyone's having a good weekend. Obviously, I bought my fishing magnet. This will be the first time I try it. I've been watching all these magnet fishing videos. Boys hyped. So the first place I'm gonna try is like the that local family pond. The rumor is this used to be a spot that uh, in the Civil War, it's supposed to be like a stop, like a camping stop. Probably pick up some cans, but you never know. Here we are. Is this gonna be good for you? Are you gonna accept this spot and not tip or sink? It's kind of mushy ground. Sweet. Okay, taking that canoe. I'm gonna go drop this magnet in this water. Let's try to get out there. Oh, your boy's gonna have to do some work. Come on, snakes. The last thing you wanna do is run into a big cottonmouth. This is a Catawba worm tree. It's been there for a long time. You guys ever smoked Catawba worm pots? I did that when I was a teenager. That was dumb. So I'm thinking the odds are gonna be kinda low finding anything in here, but you never know. For the first try at magnet fishing, why not try an old rumored to be Civil War camp spot. Here we go. Yeah. But yeah, that's the magnet you get. It's just a cheap magnet set off of Amazon. But just to try my hand at it, I thought one of these $15 sets, they give you these gloves, they give you this magnet. Why not? All right, so there is where people have been coming in. Come on, magnet, catch me something awesome. Anything? No. Throw out a little further. Nope. <laughs> Nothing. Okay. Let's go to a new spot. All right. So I'm gonna go into the clear here. Oh, I know that just jacked the camera. Jeez. Come on. Let's pull up like some old Civil War sword or something. That'd be sweet. Nothing. All right, so I'm going over. It's actually a railroad that runs up there. So I'm going over on the baseline of that. Throw it over there to see if there's anything over there. All right. It's a very clean pond. I'm, I'm glad for that, but makes for a very lackluster video. Here's the train that I was talking about. I guess the smartest thing to do would be just hit all the spots that I know people over the years have been in and out. This has pretty much been a private pond for a lot, a lot of years. At least my lifetime. Can you guys guess how old I am? I'd be interested to know if you can even get anywhere near what age I am. If anybody takes a guess at it, I'll let you know in the next one. I think what I'll do is I'm just going to take and drop and pop that magnet. Drop and pop! Maybe not. Throw and pull. The old throw and pull, huh? Man, this pond is clean, dude. Okay, my first, <laughs> my first item I've caught is a, what is probably most likely a BB or a shotgun BB. It looks like a little copper, just a little copper ball. Boop, there it goes. Okay. Exciting. Mucky, mucky mess. Okay, you guys, I think I'm about done for the day. So, f magnet fishing. It's a new hobby. Let's get this junk out of here. Oh, muddy. 
chunky. We got a blaze trails. Whew. There we go. Mini moto magnet fishing. That rolls right off the tongue. So I'm done for the day. That was my first magnet fishing trip. Uneventful. I caught one little like copper brass looking BB. I think it's gonna be fun. I'm gonna hit up some good spots, some spots that are, might catch some cool things. If you got to this point, <laughs> thanks for watching, and I will see you guys on the next one.